told me. Oh my goodness! Is that what it looks like? Wait, no. Wait a minute, bro. Bro, 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 bro. Bro, 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 hi, 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 hello. Bro, check this out. Before I get into just the vibe that I promised you guys, I'm gonna turn this camera. First off, see my little man's not here, so the blinds aren't open. This is what I was talking about. Every morning I gotta lift the blinds up for him. Cause he like the blinds open, but he not here, so I'm gonna just open them. I was just doing, just doing it to be doing. But let me go ahead and cut this. This one is open fairly. What's going on? What's going on, family? What's going on? Hold on, 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 hold on. Check this out, bro. That's all grease. I'm finna make some tacos, man. That's all grease, man, from the tacos last night. Isn't that crazy? That is wild. Anyways, <laughs> what's going on, fam? How y'all doing? What's going on? Let me wave, 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 wave. How you doing? How you doing? What's going on? So yeah, man. I told y'all I was gonna come back with a little vibe or whatnot. So I wrote down some things that I want to talk about. Okay, and um, I'm gonna make the I'm gonna warm up my tacos first, just to give people some time, and then I'm gonna go ahead and make sure that we get to the business. Um, Bible study was amazing. If you missed it, you know what I'm saying. Then that's on you. You know what I mean? Bible study was amazing. And uh, it, it was awesome. So, like I said, I'm just I'm a little hungry. I promised y'all 12. So, I like to be a man of my word. And I'm going to go ahead and let you know that first off. But, anyways, I hope y'all having a beautiful day. Uh, we not, we not, I'm, I'm not, I'm not in the vibe yet. I'm just making something to eat real quick. Making something to eat real quick. And then I'm gonna get 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 on to the to the business. I want some tacos, so that's what it is. Hold on. You know what? Let me go ahead and I don't know why I'm doing it like that. But yeah, so yeah, Bible study was amazing this morning. I mean, the Lord had a great word for us. Um if you missed it, then like I said, that's on you. It was it was really pretty much awesome. And uh I just appreciate him uh giving us that word man for real for real for the most part we was talking about uh how tall kevin hart is and how tall a lot of people have gotten it's like you know i'm the baby of the industry you know what i'm saying like i'm i'm the i'm the one that, that that's supposed to like that grew up and they don't want me to see nothing because i wasn't supposed to see nothing from the get-go and and, and it's funny because i grew up you know, Tiger grew up. Yes, Tiger grew up. And and now that I'm looking at everybody in their face, and I'm like, no, you're not the same person. What did you do? They're like, okay, we got to kill Tiger. And, I, <laughs> and that's just the God's honest truth because I know pretty much everything uh, about uh, what's going on in Hollywood. In Hollywood, and uh, I grew up in, you know, the business or whatever the case may be. But I had a I had a blessed mother that didn't put me into, you know, the private schools and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Like I stayed in home school. You know, just uh, I I I love interacting with with people. You know what I'm saying? That, that's why I love interacting with people because. I went to public school, you know what I'm saying? So <laughs> I was the I was the class clown and and all that cool stuff. And it just behooves me. Like I'm just like like gonna grow up and not be the same person. Like I don't know. I don't I don't understand. Um But that's what Bible study was about. Like a lot a lot a lot about how um these people are like taking shortcuts and yada 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 yada. I'm not, you know, like too too big on talking about like all the extra, you know, uh, uh, astronomical stuff that people ask me about. I get asked about the Illuminati a lot. I get asked about Lucifer a lot. I get asked about a lot of things. You know what I'm saying? But the truth is, 
all that stuff does actually matter, but you have to know that it's actually here right now. It's not going on in the sky like they want you to believe, guys. I'm sorry. It's not going on in the, in the sky. Like, 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 these things are actually happening right now. You know, like, like, right now. So you have to be able to, uh, depict, you know, and, and differentiate what you want to, what you want to deal with. That's pretty much what it is, you know. Um, some people, they like drama. Some people, they like to uh, solve problems. Some people, they like to uh, search for problems. And um, you have some people that actually stay away from them. I'm one of those guys that stay away from problems based off of the fact that I had problems a lot that I caused on my own. Because I just didn't want to listen to nobody at that time. You know what I'm saying? So now that I done put it all together and I done made enough mistakes to where I've learned to learn from my mistakes. It's like, man, I'm so blessed and so happy that I'm not dead. Do you understand what I'm saying? That I'm not dead and that I, I have um, pretty much pretty much cool, cool shoulder, shoulder uh, head on my shoulders. And, uh, you know, I'm saying all this before we get into what I have written down, okay? I have some things written down that I want to get into, and I'm not going to go there yet because I have to make sure that this is done. Oh, my, 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 uh, I'm warming up my tortillas, okay? We're getting ready, we're getting ready. Uh, but anyway, so, yeah, you know, like I said, I grew up in, uh, I grew up as a regular kid. Okay. If you grew up as a regular kid, you were that kid that looked at some things and you said, hell no, nah, that don't look right. Well, I'm still in that mind frame, but I'm a grown man now. So, you know, um, some things just don't look right. You know what I mean? And, and we're going to get into a few of them in a second. Hold on. I'm not lying to you. I'm, I'm dead hungry. So I got my, my tortillas. I got my tortillas. Hold on, my tortilla. I got my tortilla. My tortilla. You know? I got to have a tortilla. I'm going to put a little uh, put a little cheese in that thing with the meat. And then go run that thing off. You feel me? That's just how you got to do it. You got to run that thing off. What is that? Is that? What I think it is? No? Okay. So, yeah. Um, school was fun for me. I had I had fun in school. I, uh, I had a lot of friends and associates. I sang a lot. I, I started groups, singing groups, all that good stuff. You know what I mean? Um, and it was fun. It was always fun. Nobody ever believed Orlando. That's my life. Nobody ever believed Orlando. I said I was going to be on. I went to school. And I was like, yo, man, I'm about to be on uh, uh, Family Matters. I I'm about to be on Family Matters. And, and y'all are going to see me with Steve Urkel. <laughs> You're a liar. You're a liar. Get out of here, man. Stop it. Stop it. You. What, what's your character called? It's called 3J. 3J, that doesn't even sound like a character. Ha ha ha! Get out of here, kid. You're not gonna be on Family Matters. Hey, I'm gonna be on the Jamie Foxx show. I I I I wanna invite you guys to my house so you guys can watch the op uh, um the 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 uh, the opening of the show and stuff like that. I play I play a, a kid. Um, his name is Nelson on the show. Shut up! Not gonna be on any damn show called the Jamie Foxx show. Jamie Foxx doesn't even know you, Orlando. Ha! Story of my life. I remember my first ten thousand dollar ring, and I told my auntie. I said, Auntie, my manager just bought me a ten thousand dollar ring. We in Hawaii, and it's going down. You understand me? And she's like, yo, man, you did enough work and you're doing this thing, you're doing that thing. I'm going to get you this ring. I come back home to L.A. from Hawaii with my manager, okay? And I tell my auntie, I say, auntie, she said, I ain't never seen no real diamonds before. I said, I got diamonds upstairs, you want to see them? Auntie, 
I got a, I got a ten thousand dollar ring, Auntie. Boy, you ain't got no damn ten thousand dollar ring. <laughs> you just a liar. You just be. Your mama told me you was a liar, but I never thought you was actually a liar. Like you be lying. You just need to. You know what? You need to get on medication. That's what you do. You need to get on medication. Get on some of that medication. Some um, I'm gonna tell your mama to recommend you some medication. You need a Ritalin or something, baby. You ain't got no ten thousand dollar ring. <laughs> Cute boo boo. I went right upstairs. And I grabbed my ten thousand dollar ring. And I showed my auntie my ten thousand dollar ring. And I said, Auntie, Auntie, this is from my work, and, and then my manager bought this for me from, from Hawaii. You went to you ain't go to Hawaii. It's always a denial, like a deni like a spirit of denial. Auntie Yolanda, right now. It's some foul stuff to be Sean Combs. You understand what I'm saying to you? They're running from me, people. They're running from me. Don't run from this. Don't you run from this ass whooping. You wanted to rape kids and, and, and you wanted to, to, to jump in people's bodies and, and morph and you wanted to turn into a dog and you wanted to turn into a frog and turn me into a, a tub and turn me into uh, whatever. Do you guys understand that energy never dies? They can turn you into anything, y'all. Anything. To silence you, dog, cat, turn into a shark. Turn to anything. To shut your ass up. Stop being so stupid. We are far beyond the realm of human comprehension with the things that we are doing. This stuff has been going on since World War I. Wearing people's faces and infiltrating their families. Come on. Like you don't know that the Indians taught the Americans to peel skin. Stop playing with me. We're not going to play these games with, 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 with Orlando Brown. That's not... <laughs> no. no. Wake up, y'all. So I got my tacos. Hold on, wait a minute. So I'm going to talk to... Hold on, I have my tacos going. Do you understand me? So now that we got the tacos... All right. <laughs> okay. I'm going to go in here. Sit down. And talk about some of the stuff I wrote down. I wrote down some stuff because it doesn't bother me. It just behooves me. You understand me? Once upon a time, I was Martin Luther King. Once upon a time, I was Jesus Christ. They playing too many games. Why everybody want to kill Orlando Brown? Why everybody want to do stuff to me to make me come out of character? Huh? You know when I step in the room, what happens? You all know. There it is. Okay, so let's grab the water. And get to the business. Okay. Okay. So, here we go. On my way to the room, so we can go ahead and talk about a few things. Just a few things, not, not, not too many things, but just some things that are on my mind. Uh... Okay, so, hi, hi, Ron, <laughs> yeah, let me see, uh, let me go to here real quick, sorry, there we go, there we go, I'm sorry, I had to figure out what the list was, the list is written in my phone, mm. so, the first thing on my list is, this right here, The first thing on my list is how Kevin Hart
is actually that girl that played Coop. Y'all know that show? A little short, dark skin girl that played Coop on All American. That's Kevin Hart. That's what they want me to do. They want me to cut my, my penis off and willingly <laughs> look at it. They want me to willingly cut my dick off and be a stud. While, while Magic Johnson is running around in my fucking face. This is just one of the things that I had to talk about. I know it's funny. I know it's... God, I, I didn't want to do this, y'all. I didn't want to do this. But they want Magic Johnson to be running around in my fucking body in my face. This tall-ass rich man, supposedly. Okay? To be running around like he's Orlando Brown. You know, Coop, yeah, yeah, Coop. The short one, Coop, Lil Coop, Lil Coop from All American. Oh, yeah, and, and, and oh, yeah, all right. We got, oh, Catherine Jackson just pulled up. Hey, Papa Smurf, tell him you, Catherine Jackson, stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Okay. So that little, that little chick, Coop. That's Kevin Hart. Mm-hmm. That's Kevin Hart. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. You ain't gotta put all that shit you... I don't give a fuck if you watching or not, nigga. And... What's the magnifying glass supposed to mean, nigga? You're still Janet Jackson. It doesn't matter what you're talking about, nigga. You're Janet Jackson, nigga. You're trying to kill your own son, nigga. So fuck your magnifying glass. Period. So back to what I'm saying. Coop. You know? Coop. From All American. That's the real Kevin Hart. That's the real Kevin Hart. The short... You know, the short, dark-skinned girl, she got shot in the last episode and stuff like that, uh, the last season or whatever the case may be. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know, that's the real Kevin Hart. So, that's what they want us to do as black men. They want us to abandon our child, our children. They don't want us to look, they want, they want black men to look... They want black men to look inferior, bro. They don't want us looking like we don't. We, we, they don't want us looking like we can take care of our children. They don't want us looking like we have our mind together. They don't want us looking like we have our lives together, period. Our families, none of that. None of that. And, 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 and since Mr. Will Smith is having problems as a man, I'm supposed to. You know? Because Orlando, Orlando's not supposed to have his wife and, and, and all that. It, it, it doesn't make any sense. It doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't make any sense. Because you're my children, that's why. That's why they're doing this to y'all and us. Because you're my children and I'm Jesus Christ. That's why. Yeah, 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 yeah. And my cousin Aaron, they Christian want to be Jesus. You know, Jay-Z, Jay-Z wants to be Jesus. So, so... He's he's like like doing all this weird shit and making it seem like I need to go through this and they're making it seem like I need to be studied and all this bullshit put me through extra shit that I don't need to go through threatening my wife with her kids and all this bullshit just to make it seem like I got a fucking problem. Cause I won't let that nigga be me. The fact still remains is I don't give a fuck. My cousin has a problem. Okay? My family has a problem. They have a fucking problem, bro. They have a problem. I don't give a fuck. They have a problem, bro. They have a problem. They don't want to acknowledge the fact that I'm Michael Jackson. 
That's it. You know what I'm saying? They don't want to acknowledge the fact that I'm motherfucking Michael Jackson. Okay? Okay? And my cousin's wife is the one who killed Martin Luther King Jr. Okay? And she's trying to hide that shit so she don't got to be Bubbles. Because the person that killed Jesus, yeah, that's, that's, that's Bubbles, nigga. That's Bubbles. So magnify glass that shit. Nobody give a fuck about your magnifying glass, nigga. What are you talking about? So that was number one on my list. I believe number two on my list. Because I don't know if... Wait, I'm trying to see what's going on. Hold on. Um, I'm trying to see exactly what's going on. Um... Number two, I don't want to. I don't want to hit the button and then it, and then I gotta start my live again, bro. Um, hold on, let me try though. I gotta get number two. I'm sorry, I told you. I told you. I told you. I told you. I said it was gonna go down. I said. I said if I press the button. I said if I press the button. It's gonna go down. You feel me? So, anyways, I'm back. Um. Mm, number two is uh. Mm, that's good. It's really good. So, number two. Cause you know how Raven married this weird looking white girl? You know that? Like how Raven married this weird looking white girl out of nowhere. Like <laughs> Raven just married some awkward ass uh uh heroin looking addict ass girl. And oh there you go, the Papa Smurf. Oh, so you must not be mad. Great, I'm telling the truth, nigga. So when it comes down to it, it's like, um, you know, Raven, Raven, Papa Smurf, you know, Raven, <laughs> Papa Smurf, a.k.a. Raven, you know, Raven married the white girl, the white girl, you know, the white girl, who's the white girl, Annalisa, Raven and Annalisa are married. You better not be, nigga. You better not be, Raven. That's right. There we go, nigga. Damn. Back me up. Back me up. That's right, nigga. Back me up. That's right. Back me up. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Back me up, nigga. Back me up. So anyways, yeah. Raven Mary. Raven Mary. <laughs> Raven Mary. The white girl, okay? And the white girl with the green eyes or blue eyes or whatever is actually Annalisa. So her wife is Chelsea, nigga. Her wife is Annalisa, nigga. You feel me? No bullshit, bro. <laughs> you feel me? I swear. So I just want you guys to understand how much I love y'all. You feel me? I don't know these damn tacos. Walt Disney. Walt Disney cool with me. Walt Disney is cool with me. I like Walt Disney. Walt, um, Walt is real cool. He's he, he, he I gotta watch what I say because, um, Walt Walt has a Walt Walt is real cool. I can just say that Walt Disney is Walt Disney is really 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 nice, and um. You know he 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 uh he blessed he blessed us all. You know what I'm saying? Um, with an opportunity. You know what I'm saying? With what he built. So I'll never say nothing bad about Mr. Walt Disney. I'll, I'll never say nothing bad about Mr. Walt Disney. But um, anyways, we just kicking it. So I'm uh on my last taco. I don't know what third was on the list. Oh, I can't remember what third was. Mm. Mm. But no, 
No interviews, man. I'm like, cause you know what? Like when people interview Kanye, bro, it be some people that actually respect him. You need some tacos, cuz? <laughs> Shut up. You need some tacos. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, I need some taco. You always know how to make me shut up, cuz. <laughs> you always know how to make me shut up, man. You need some tacos, man. Well, come. Oh, and let me let bring your ass home. <laughs> anyway, man. So. Look, check this out, man. Um, are you going to get back? Mm. Yeah, actually, we're doing um, we're doing some things, man. Uh, that are pretty awesome. awesome. We're doing some pretty awesome things, man. Um, we got the uh, all I can say is the Orlando Brown show is uh is is not too far around the corner, bro. And, and it's been a long time coming. It's been a long time coming, so um, the Orlando Brown show is, is definitely um, uh, I'm excited about it. That's something I'm excited about. Um, yeah, so that's what's up. And uh, you know, I just been waiting a long time, man. Yeah, I've been waiting a long time, man. If it wasn't for my cousin, I'll tell you the truth. If it wasn't for my cousin. I probably I, I would not be even close to even having the Orlando Brown show. Um, my cousin is a, is a a very very big reason um, to why I'm 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 so motivated because my cousin really believes in me. Sometimes I I just record songs just so he can just just so he can hear it. You know what I'm saying? I love I love the fact that I get opinions and stuff, but my cousin mean the world to me so. I like to I like to hear his opinion and get his get his mind frame because we got the same mind and uh and uh I just like his opinion you know what I'm saying I like when he get 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 excited because then that makes me that makes me go even crazier as far as um working out uh uh staying out of trouble uh you know uh, any of that stuff it just motivates me you know these last two videos man it just keeps me that that just that, that keeps me just all the way focused, just knowing that there's somebody out there that actually uh that cares. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to my cousin, man. Shout out to my partner, man. I love you. Um, uh, all this stuff going on, all this stuff going on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Family first, definitely. All right, bet. Um, so yeah, uh, hmm, I'm trying to figure out. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. That's what happens when, when you know, when baby mamas, are, when baby mamas are jealous and they sell their souls and they able to do some stupid shit to to try to fuck your shit up. <laughs> How about did it hurt trying to turn into Danielle, bitch? <laughs> did they break your booty? You went through hell to steal that car and get that baby up. Huh? You got me to... <laughs> just to try to cause a problem. Oh man, look. God is so good. Um, anyways. So the third thing on my list. The third thing. Um I don't even want to say it, man. I don't even I don't even want to say it. I don't even want to say it because, you know, uh, uh, you know, you have to have understanding about some of this stuff. You know, you have to have understanding. You have to have respect. And you can't be just saying stuff just to say stuff. You know what I'm saying? If I say that, then I'll just be saying it just to say it. It's just like bullying people, you know. You don't bully people when you have a a gift. You just don't. You don't bully people. I'm not that kind of person, bro. Like God gave me an organic gift, and I'm not here to bully nobody. I'm not here to. I'm not here to use my gift for bad. I'm just not. You know what I'm saying? Um. So I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. I'm. Um. That'd that'd be being messy and stuff like that. 
Um, and I'm not here to be messy. I'm just here to 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 uh, get my cut and let y'all know what's really going down. And you know, uh, give y'all that vibe that I, I I told you guys specifically that I would give you guys. And uh, um, I'm just happy. I'm happy. I'm uh, I have a lot of joy in my heart. I have a lot of joy in my soul. I don't know why. I can't explain it. I don't know where it comes from. Uh, it's very, 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 very hard for people to make me mad. Um, cause I'm very happy. Like I'm a very happy person. And so I would hate to invoke something evil or in, in pro- provoke somebody to do something to me that, that, that doesn't need to, that doesn't need to happen, you know? So, um, uh, I'll just make sure that, uh, that I, I, I keep on using my gift for good and keep on manifesting blessings and not provoking demons. I'd rather do that. So, um, anyways, I love you guys. I hope you took what you took from this and it was whatever it was funny or whatever. I don't care. Whatever. I just, I hope that you were appeased and, um, you know, uh, no, actually, Dr. Phil is a dope guy. Uh, even though he's, he's Lucifer, he, Dr. Phil, what he did was, you know, uh, uh, he put me in a position to where I was supposed to get swarmed up. But because of who I am on the inside and the man of God in me and how God is in me and not on me, um, I, I was able to assess the situation the right way because of the Holy Spirit. And, um, the intentions were bad, but what was there was good. So I can't tell you that Dr. Phil makes me mad. Doesn't make me mad at all, actually. <laughs> I played his ass. <laughs> Two year old still in the belly, nigga. <laughs> Ask me no damn questions about my kids. I don't gotta tell you nothing, nigga. Yeah, the two year old still in the belly, nigga. I can tell you nothing you talking about i ain't gonna tell you nothing yeah i don't know none of my kids names one's name is purple one name is pink one name is erica badu another one name is jay-z and another one name is ice cube bitch i don't know i don't know i don't know okay damn it and my grandmama is farrakhan all right and janet jackson is martin luther king senior okay and John Travolta is James Earl Ray. He shot me years ago. How you niggas gonna act like Jesus gonna die and then come back to life and then find out he's back to life and then be like, I'm not gonna curse. No, nigga, that shit hurt it. You niggas beat me. You niggas put vinegar in my mouth when I wanted water. Oh, you niggas is ridiculous. Then on top of that, on top of that, you niggas won't even let me, you won't even let me get my house. Oh, God. Like Martin Luther King just walked inside of a church and everybody said, oh, for nothing. Everybody know the man was Jesus. That's why James Elroy killed him. Damn it. I can't deal with this. That's why they killed them. Well, I mean, that's why they killed me. You ain't gonna keep killing your damn kid. Mary and Joseph, you're crazy. That's what I'm talking about, man. I'm telling you the truth, man. I'm telling you the truth. What you mean to tell me? You're gonna beat me with whips, drag me up a hill, put a cross on my back, Scratch me with nails, put nails in my hands, put nails in my feet. Don't give me nothing at all. Then you want to take and beat me? <laughs> you want to take and beat me? Because I chose to save humanity? Oh, no, you stupid. Like I told you, nigga, it hurt it. You can sell your soul for things. But I guess I was tired of some shit. I said, I want to sell my soul to save everybody. <laughs> nice nigga. Then they keep turning me into a damn kid. The hell? No, not this time. Nigga done grew up. I'm not having it. This, I'm not taking this shit. 
You're not putting me in no more diamonds. You're going to give me what I deserve, damn it. That's never land in the whole damn pie. Ain't none of you niggas Michael Jackson. None of you niggas. This is ridiculous. Yeah, I heard it. Damn it. You put nails in my hand, nigga. You put, nigga, you, nigga, you beat me with a whip. Nigga, you put vinegar on me after you done beat me with a whip. All cut. You put a crucifix on my head. Nigga, you, you, come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. You niggas, look, man. You, you think I'm going through all this for no reason? I'm telling you the truth. Crazy, man. Y'all crazy. Want to take my skin and wear my damn body and be like, yes, I saved all of you. <laughs> I identified all of you. And yes, I'm God. I'm Jesus. And I'm this and I'm that. And, and nigga, you fake. Do you ain't. Do nobody want to come see you, nigga. They want to meet the person that actually identified them from out the womb, nigga. Not the person that tried to rape the man that identified, identified them from out the womb. You want to rape me and put my skin on and then tell them that, it's, that, that, you, that you was the savior, nigga? You a weird nigga, bro. Lucifer, you weird on blood, you weird nigga. You weird. I'm talking to you, John Travolta, on everything I love. Nigga, you weird. And Jay-Z, you a bitch. You just mad because Daniel don't want to be with your ass. You a weird ass nigga. Oh, my mama. Don't nobody like your ass. Nigga, and you don't even put on deodorant, nigga. And your dick little, she said. You little dick, nigga. The fuck are you talking about? Everybody know Jay-Z got a little dick. Superhead told everybody. Superhead said, I got in back of the limo with Jay-Z. And he had his pants down with his little dick out. <laughs> Oh God! All right, man. Look, I'm done with I'm done with this vibe, bro. I'm done with this vibe. I love y'all too much, man. <laughs> oh man, we are all weird. He said, "Nah, nigga, I'm weird too. That's why. That's why it's it's going down. Weird is in. Weird is my bandwagon. Join in. <laughs> weird is my bandwagon. But anyways, man, love you." Y'all just keep it 100. Tell the truth, man. Tell the truth. You got a head up, nigga. Run it. You feel me? Don't run from none of them. Take all your heads up. You feel me? And, uh, we 100 miles and running. Ain't no turning back, man. Ain't no turning back. It's your boy, O. Brown, a.k.a. Michael Jackson. I'm out this bitch. <laughs>